Welcome to a business finance short problem solving lecture. We will now have a look at problem study problem 15-8 in page 481 from the 8th edition of our textbook. Here's a view of the problem. Let's, let's go ahead and highlight key facts provided in the problem. Burlington Western Company is issuing, is planning to issue a commercial paper in the amount of 20 million dollars. So that's another way of borrowing money. Um, the firm is obviously assured by the investment firm that it can raise the funds easily with this method. The commercial paper will carry a 270 day maturity, so we can consider it as 9 months basically, and it will have an interest rate of 11%, annual interest rate of 11%. In addition, the firm will have to pay fees to the investment bank in the amount of $200,000 to bring the issue, the, the commercial bank issue to the market and place it. What would be the effective cost of this commercial paper issued by Burlington, West, Burlington Western? So we can, um, as usual, go ahead and first calculate the interest expense associated with this issue. Uh, the interest rate is 11% and we are issuing $20 million worth of commercial paper. We are borrowing for uh, we are borrowing effectively for 270 days out of the 360 days. As a result, the interest amount totals $1,650,000. Um, recall now, we need to make a note here, note, recall that in the case of a commercial paper requires both the interest and the fees to be paid in advance in advance or you can say prepaid okay so having said that we can now go ahead and figure the effective cost the APR of this commercial paper issue so the costs include the interest rate in the amount of one million six hundred and fifty thousand dollar plus the two hundred thousand dollar fee and the principal we are borrowing is twenty million dollars However, because the interest and the fees are prepaid, we are just effectively borrowing this amount that we see in the denominator of this ratio. And then we need to uh, multiply this result to annualize it. We multiply it by 360 over the borrowing period of 270 days. So this calculation comes out as 33.59%. And this is the effective cost of this commercial paper issue. So one of the lessons learned from this in, in the case of a commercial paper is that the interest expense and the fees are both prepaid. So that affects the cost of borrowing. It actually increases the cost of borrowing. So that solves our problem. Uh, looking forward to see you in our next video.